Well, my journey to prosthetics and orthotics wasn't a traditional one. I guess I stumbled upon the profession. I kind of got into the field after changing my major multiple times between wanting to be a teacher, wanting to be a doctor, and then maybe going into public health. This was something that met my goals of wanting to help people and then it also had that added part of fabrication, which I completely fell in love with. I feel like it's like a perfect combination of a science and also an art. You take a patient from zero to 100, you're walking with them, literally sometimes. We get to help facilitate their goals, and I think that's a really unique aspect of our field that not everyone else in healthcare gets to do. This is what I wanted to do because you do help people, but then in helping those people, you're also helping like their family and their caregivers and all that. NUPOC did a really good job of making sure that we all kind of stayed on the same track together and no one was left behind because of their previous experience or inexperiences. Most people in the field today have studied here and the people that I'm in the classes with today are some of the best people I've ever met. The moment I walked into the department, I kind of just fell in love with it and I just knew off the bat that this was for me. One of the biggest benefits of a hybrid program was that I was able to work full time as a practitioner's assistant during the first six months before coming on site. So while I was doing my coursework, I was also able to get the clinical experience and see what I was learning played out every day in the clinic I was in. I loved the hybrid system. It worked for me personally. I just felt like I had more time to do like fun things and travel because everything's online. So I just bring my iPad or computer and there's school. And it definitely helps you towards the end of the program when you're looking for residencies and you can kind of get away from Chicago, you can go home, you can finish your studies up and then focus on where you want to be next. You can go to those interviews, you can go to meetings that are closer to where you want to be. I actually find that I've been able to rely on my peers a lot with just not so much of school but getting used to being in Chicago. That has really helped me not to feel as lonely as I thought I was gonna feel. It kind of feels like a big family. Like we are always hanging out. It doesn't feel like we're just classmates. It feels like we're family. I even feel like I'm part of community with uh, the professors because they're all very into uh, us as students and very invested in our careers and our education. They really want us to succeed and they are like an encouragement, but also this resource of knowledge that's very valuable. At NUPOC, you're really taught so many different ways and methods to do orthotics and prosthetics. And then now moving on from NUPOC, I'll be able to take my whole toolbox of different things that I've been taught here and then apply that to specific patients in the best way possible. I met a bunch of people in the field. I loved almost everyone I talked to, all of the patients, all of the clinicians. Everyone had such a passion that was palpable in this field. I'm happy that they pushed me the way they did. So I guess that was just it. <laughs> Love at first sight for me, I guess.